when you're with the Flintstones. Dabba yabba do time. do time. A dabba do time. <laughs> Welcome to Hashtag Just, Just saying. saying. I am Tara. And I'm Sean. Of, so. of course you are. Of course you are. Now welcome to Bedrock. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Goodness, goodness. So. We always try to have a yabba do time. Uh, we do have a yabba dubba do time. In due time. Sometime. A little time. <laughs> a little bit of the time. So, let me get it all out of the way right now. Right? So, we post up the first, first uh, 20 to 30 uh, minutes of the show on YouTube as video. You can check that out. For the video folks, you can listen to the full show on iTunes, SoundCloud, Stitcher, Stitcher. Google Play, Spotify. Spotting. <laughs> and it would be awesome if you have the Anchor app or you want to download it for free. You can listen to us on there. Drop your anchor and listen to and us. Drop an anchor and listen. And um, we're going to start begging again because February is Valentine's and we would love it <laughs> if you would show us some love and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thump, thump. Thump, thump. Thump, thump. Thump, thump. Thump, thump. That's like the beginning of Hard and Rock and Roll, isn't it? Yeah. Thump, thump. Boom, boom. Hard of rock and roll still beating. Careful, the news might sue us. Uh, well, Huey has an ear thing, so he probably couldn't hear us. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was one of his band members that tried to say, oh, Ray Parker Jr.'s Ghostbusters is just like this song. Uh, but, okay, hang on. I don't on. think it was. Hang on now. I If you listen to the songs back to back, Ghostbusters is very similar in beat to I want a new drug. It's I want a new drug, right? That they were saying? I, I, over the years, I've heard two songs. I want a new drug and... Mm-hmm. Shit, I forget the other one. <laughs> we'll just say I want a new drug because it's very similar. So I really don't think that Ray Parker Jr.'s people were trying to copy his song. I, I mean, if it was intentional... It's not like... It, I mean, Vanilla Ice doing Ice Ice Baby. No, no, ripping no. someone else's and trying to say, "Oh, it was an extra." <laughs> at the end, I feel very old talking about this right now, because I don't know. We are. I don't know our demographic, but I don't know how many people listen to us who know who Vanilla Ice is. <laughs> Vanilla Ice was a rapper before he had a show where he was building houses. He tried to rap. And you see, I did the air quotes. He tried to rap. <laughs> and, um, no, he sampled uh, Queen and David Bowie's Under Pressure. Dun 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 And he claimed that there was one extra beat that made it completely different. He's like, no, 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 mine is dun 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 dun. Something like that. It was like, shut up, vanilla. We know you copied. We know you ripped it off. We know you copied. Is that's like when you copy somebody else's you like? You did the song. You did it. That's like when you copy off someone's paper in class and you try to purposely make one wrong <laughs> so that the teacher doesn't know you copied off the other person's paper. Exactly. <laughs> it's like, oh no 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 no! There's an extra beat. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I've been on it. Fuck it. I've been on an '80s kick. Um, I've been listening to some '80s jams this week. Sweet. All good. All good. Um, today stuff sucks. Uh, you know, I don't. I'm not trying to be like that person. I am. <laughs> <laughs> Sean's like me. I can't enjoy right anything today. I mean, I. I don't know. There's very, very little uh, new-ish music that I listen to. Um, it's just, it's just, it's, I don't, I don't like to make fun of what people listen to, because believe me, I listen to some shit. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, no, it's like, you know how you, like, you have those songs on your playlist that you'd be like, man, I would never admit to anybody that I listen to this song, <laughs> but like, it comes on and you're like, I'm all out of love. <laughs> like you, like you. So lost without <laughs> Thank you. you. Fucking Sean knows it. Of course you do. 
Like, and then it's like you just jam. And it's like... <laughs> oh, it's like in the late 80s and early 90s when yeah. guys that did yeah. wouldn't admit they listened to New Kids on the Block. Right. I did. Oh, look at Sean. He's I like, know, right I here. I didn't. I didn't. I still listen to some of those songs from then. Shit. <laughs> I didn't, but it's not that like there's anything wrong with it. Like I was, um, I was talking to a friend of mine last night, and she was talking about the Super Bowl, the halftime show of the Super Bowl. Mm-hmm. I know you didn't watch the show, but did you hear anybody yakking about the halftime show? It was J Lo. Nobody at my work gave a shit about the Super Bowl. Okay, it was J Lo and Shakira. Bless now you. I know, I know those names. Um, I can't give you much more than that. I mean, I could probably. Uh, figure out what J-Lo was singing. Uh, but my friend was all into it because she, apparently, I didn't even know. She's like, I'm a big Shakira fan. I'm like, who are you? <laughs> I don't even know you anymore. Um, but I was like, you know what? That's fine. I said, I watched it. I kind of was in and out with it. I kind of turned the volume down a little bit. Um, it's just, it's it, it's not my type of music, but that doesn't make it bad, right. is what I was saying. So it's like, New music today, it's not that it's bad, it's just it's not my type of shit. It's shit. <laughs> <laughs> They're coming off like old fogies right now. Like, listen to these these uh, like uh, rap songs and hip-hop songs like, yeah. that come on. Mm-hmm. You think, they grew up wanting to be a singer. Right. They finally got the opportunity and they record this shit. <laughs> you know, the hip-hop that I listen to now... Not like, like the, the old Belle Bid DeVoe and all that. Oh, well, Belle Bid DeVoe was like R&B. They were like R&B hip-hop. Hip-hop? Yeah, they were like R&B-ish hip-hop. It was like, poison. Do me, baby. <laughs> Six o'clock on the swatch, watch. No time to chill. <laughs> Got a date. Can't be late. Hey. hey. The girl's S- gonna fuck me. <laughs> That's not what they said. <laughs> Don't bring naughtiness <laughs> into it. Don't do it. Fuck me, baby. <laughs> So, like, I forgot what I said. Oh, so, like, the new, like, the, like, I like hip-hop and rap, but, like, I don't listen, I don't, well, I listen to old school, but the only new stuff that I listen to now is stuff that's out of, like, Australia Hmm. and, and, like, England. Yeah, so I gotta go out of the country to get hip-hop that I like that's new. Sad. It is sad. I mean, I just don't, I don't like, like, what the, I, uh, I can't even... Everybody wants Little in their name now. Have you noticed that? Nope. It's like Lil something, Lil Wayne, Lil whatever, Lil Nas, Lil Buh. It's like, why don't you want to be big? <laughs> why, do you wanna, why don't you want to be Big Wayne? <laughs> like, why that way you can say you have a Big Wayne. <laughs> like, why do you want to be Little? Little <laughs> little Dap, Little Luh, Little Homie, Lil Buh. It's like, why don't you want to be big? Everybody it wants to be like Lil John. I, maybe everybody. Yeah. Like, why would they want to be like little John though? I mean. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. But I mean, he had a, he made a career out of just saying yes and okay. Amazing, yep. huh? Okay. He made a background <laughs> vocal. What? Yeah. It's like what? And he does that in almost all the songs and. Yeah, and he gets paid good. for it. And he gets paid for it. That's fucked up. Yeah. I liked it when so, I liked it when he was on the episode of um, what's the Chappelle show. Yeah, I knew you were gonna go Chappelle show. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> when he's uh, talking to him, like yeah, the, the split thing, so yeah, he's talking to himself, it's awesome. <laughs> so it's like, I don't know. I don't know why everybody wants to be little. It may, <laughs> maybe it's some street thing. I don't understand. I'm like, like Tom Hanks. We want to be big. I know. Why wouldn't you want to be big? <laughs> I'm waiting for like a, a surge of rappers who just take big and be like, I'm big. Big Papa. Big Papa. Biggie. See? But even Biggie, he went by Biggie Smalls. <laughs> like he wanted to be little too. <laughs> Why don't you want to be big? <laughs> it's all right to be big. I don't understand. Like it's a street. Is it a street cred thing? Someone needs to comment below. I need to know. Um. Uh, I just, what is the little thing? Is it like I, I need to know? If you know, let me know. <laughs> you can also write to us on Facebook, Instagram, Tumblr, and Twitter. See how I weave that right in? Yeah. Yes. Good job. If you happen to know why everybody wants to be little, <laughs> let me know. I want to know. So anyway, so yeah, I got to go out of the country to get hip hop that I like. 
Mm. So, such something. as I do, I do, I, I. You know, that's what I like about Spotify. It's like you'll go to like one artist, and then like below it'll so be you're like spotting stuff. I know. On, well, you can spot us on Spotify, All right? And if you go to like one artist, they'll have like artists that, like you like this artist. Check out these artists. So I'm like, oh, I like skim. I'm like, oh yeah, let me look. <laughs> Yeah, look. I look. Last week I had the fucking. What is that? What is that? Um, ninety nine red balloons by Nina. Oh yeah. Yeah. Ninety nine red balloons. Every time I hear that, I think about when it was on. Um, uh, I think it was a wedding star. Was it? I think. Yeah. That's one of the few Adam Sandler movies I like. Yeah, I, I like his early stuff. No. That I, li- I like. Madison. Yeah, I like the Wedding Singer. It's probably just because it's all the eighties yeah. stuff. Yeah. But he got a, a huge Netflix deal. Did he? Yeah, just recently. Did your mic go out? I think so. No, I hear you. Not a little bit. Not like no, it was a minute ago. No, I hear you. What? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay. I'm, I think Jesus. I'm huh? So. <laughs> yeah. Um. Well, because this is another one of those things where it's like I'm trying to figure out very quickly if this is a story I want to tell on the show because it's probably inappropriate. <clears throat> but that's why we're not listed as family. Uh, we are not listed family friendly. Absolutely not. Well, have you ever like that. have you ever, like okay, have you ever dropped something in the bathroom? So? <laughs> no. No, I'm, I mean like in the public restroom. Like you go into a public restroom. So? Okay, let me get into this. I draw. I, all right. Bathroom story. It was. Uh, yeah, it's a bathroom story. I haven't had one in a while. <laughs> You're welcome. So I was. You are I, went to, I went to the bathroom and I stood up. All right. <laughs> I. I mean, I had to. <laughs> you better finish that in a different way. What? I went to the bathroom and then yeah, I, I went fin- to the bathroom standing up. No, I said I stood up when I was done. I went to the. I went to the restroom, and she then did her business. I she finished. Stood up. I finished what I was doing. <laughs> Every, all right, everything was all set except my pants were buttoned, all right? Let's be adults. Be an adult, for God's sakes. I can't go through my pants. I don't have that kind of life. You don't want to be that person. Be like, oh, accident? No, it's Sprite. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh. <laughs> no, no, just Sprite. So right, yeah, I know. Sure. And then people are like, uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> you peed yourself. Yeah, I know. So I blew my nose, right? And then I, you know, I went to throw the, the thing. And I went to, whew, I went to get it in the basket, and I'll be damned if it, it didn't miss and hit the floor. So I went to go pick it up, and being me, I immediately like I went to bend down, and I have a shit back. My back is horrible. And I went that. To, yeah, it's bad. And I went to bend, and then I thought to myself, and then I immediately like jerked straight up. And then oh, I thought, do because, that. well, I know, because I thought to myself, self? Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, because there's, all right, I should explain further. There's a trash bin, and right, Im- immediately right next to the trash bin is this big metal cabinet where they keep like towel, like uh, hand towels, like uh, the paper towel, the dispenser shit. So, and cleaning products. <laughs> Because when people do revenge poops, they gotta clean. <laughs> so well, you're supposed to. So I went to bend down, and I was very, very close to the edge of the cabinet. So I, I kind of stood back up, and I thought, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just do up my pants real quick, because I thought to myself, this is how I think sometimes, right? Because I immediately thought to myself, if so, I, if I pass out, I don't want somebody coming in here, and my goddamn pants are down. Because I felt like my pants would fall on the way to, to me hitting the ground. <laughs> you know? Oh, shit. Yes. I felt like that would happen. I'm like, with my life, that will happen. And I'll be passed out. My <laughs> pants will be around my knees. And then they'll be like, what the fuck was happening in here? <clears throat> and then I'll have to explain myself. And <laughs> that is the worst. <laughs> Be like, no, no, you don't understand. I bent down to pick up a Kleenex. Sure you did. Why were your pants off? Who's in here with you? 
well, the pants are off because I, you know, I like a breeze. I don't know. Like, I'd have no explanation for why my pants would be off. They're like, you were across the room. Why were your pants off? No, oh, things happen. I don't know. Air drying. Yeah, yeah. Air drying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm allowing the caress of the uh, vent to uh, do its thing. Oh. My goodness. So, I mean, it's just one of those things. You know? I don't know. I'm, oh, I know. So, that's a little food for thought. I mean, you might want to tighten up your pants. Because you never know what's going to happen. Everybody ready right? pull up your pants? You can dance if you pull up your pants. <coughs> well, that's <laughs> definitely, yeah. That's definite. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, you don't, you just don't want to have that kind of day. <laughs> Tuesday... Worst day of the week. I went to, yeah, it was a bad Tuesday this week. But I went, I had to go get my oil changed. I still have to get mine. So I went, I left work early, and I went to get my oil changed. And I got to the dealership, and the guy was, I was like way early. Because uh, I misjudged how long it would take to get there. <laughs> this better be early and late. So I sat in the, um... In the waiting room. And I sat on one side of the waiting room. There's like this little table. Table for two. And I was by myself. And I sat there with my phone. And I have this thing on my phone where I can play like old school Nintendo games. So I'm sitting there playing Tecmo Bowl. Nice. Hell yeah, nice. So I'm playing Tecmo Bowl and I'm minding my own business. And on the other side of the room, there's a TV. Which was on something. And... Uh, this girl came in, and she looked like college student age. And she sat down, and she was, like, doing her homework or yeah, something. Yeah, her. She should be doing more. <laughs> She's, like, doing her homework. I don't know. She had a laptop. She was doing shit. So I didn't really pay much attention to her. I'm trying to win on Tecmo Bowl. <laughs> and all of a sudden, I realized that she's, like... <laughs> so I look up. I'm, like, what the fuck? And then she's, like, staring at the TV, which apparently was showing, like, Ellen or something. And she's just chuckling her ass off. And it's like, like she had her, she like closed her laptop and she's just leaning forward. And I'm like, you're not going to get your homework done that way. <laughs> That's not how you get your homework done. I don't think i do it for you. I don't think Ellen would care if uh, your homework wasn't or was not done. Or that you failed. Or that you failed. She, she ain't going to get you good grades in college, lady. Right. Keep working. Keep working. Anyway, I was Keep just. Uh, yeah, Keep yeah, yeah, yeah. So, anyway, I left her to, to her business because I had Tecmo Bowl. I had a Super Apparently Bowl. Apparently she wasn't doing any business. I had a Super Bowl to win. <laughs> did I win? I did not. <laughs> now I know how the 49ers felt. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Anyway, so... It's been a it's been a very weird week. Mm. I know. It's one of those things it's like, oh thank fuck it's over. I couldn't wait for Friday. It's like this week needs to end. Yeah, and then we get to today and it mm. dragged by almost like a Tuesday. It did it dragged by you know what? It oh it did drag by and I was listening to like I said, I was listening to uh Spotify where you can listen to us. Yay! Uh, I am plug us. I am doing the I am fucking plugging the shit. Uh, you know, subscribe. Subscribe. Get over to YouTube. Show love. Subscribe. So please. I mean, I was listening to that and then I noticed that my my phone battery was getting very low. Ooh. So I was like, damn, I had I had to stop listening so that I could charge. Charge. Because charge. iPhone I'm I'm really fucking I mean, come on, Apple. Come get on. on. Get on. We, we, we want to do two things at once. I want to charge, and I want to listen to stuff. And they make it impossible. Oh. Dicks. <laughs> exactly. Anyway, so what what have, what have you have <clears throat> here? What's what's your situation? Well. We, we, we yapped about Baby Yoda last week. Yep, and I still have one more other thing about Baby Yoda. Do ya? A.K.A. the child. Yes, finally, thank you. 
Because I don't have any stories like she does with the bathroom. <laughs> Outside of here, I've just been switching my little phases that I get into with my movies. I don't understand that. Everybody has to go to the bathroom. How am I the only person with bathroom stories? <laughs> Everybody's got to go. I'm excited it happens in the bathroom when I go. <laughs> <laughs> You're not thinking I'm going to fall and crack your head open with your pants down? Nope. Oh, all right, just me. <laughs> just me. No. For me, it's just like mm. changing my movie phases. I'm getting mm -hmm. out of the Ghostbusters phase, and I'm in the Star Wars now. <laughs> You're getting out of the Ghostbusters phase, and then in like three months, the movie's going to be out. Yeah, mm. then I'll be back in the phase. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I've been on the Star Wars phase now. and uh, I'm excited for the movie. I really mm -hmm. am. The, the new Ghostbusters movie, I'm psyched mm -hmm. for it. I can't wait to see it. Me too. And you know what? That son of a bitch... I'm sorry to interrupt you. But that son of a bitch, Paul uh, Feig... Yeah, he is a son of a bitch, yeah. He is a son of a bitch. Son he of was bitch. The, He was the, uh... I'm a boy, I ass in molasses. <laughs> That's from, um... Spooky and the Bandit. Uh... <coughs> oh, right. Sean. Shit. Now I have to cut. <laughs> cut. I know. So anyway... So, Buttons. Paul Feig. Boom! Yes, he's the director of the 2016... Boom! Titanic piece of shit, Ghostbusters. And now he's asking Jason Reitman if he can make the 2016 movie canon and make it part of the universe that of the movie that he's doing. Is there drugs? <laughs> Precisely. Yeah. Fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. See, because, because it's like when, when this movie was announced, this is I'm going to explain why I'm so upset so that everybody can be like, wow, Tara's, Paul's an asshole. Tara's really high strung about this. It's not that I'm high strung about this. Believe me. It's that this man, when this movie was announced and Jason Reitman said, I'm going to make a Ghostbuster movie for the Ghostbuster fans because this one wasn't it. He came out and he blasted him. And he's like, how dare you? And, you know, my movie and you shouldn't be making a movie. And he's shit all over it before a trailer or anything. Paul shit on Jason's Jason. movie. Yeah. He didn't want him to do it. And he's like, uh, he no. Didn't look, he didn't look at his before yeah. shitting on the other two? Exactly. The originals? As a matter of fact, it was, it was basically. Better than his together? It was basically like they were saying that Jason was disrespecting Paul by making this movie. No, he wants to please us. Like, Paul didn't. Paul did not. And so, because Paul was one of those people like, it's my movie. All right, well, we have to sit through it. Oh, it's shitty, so it, it is your it's movie. It's shitty, it is your movie! <laughs> so now that, like, a trailer is dropped, as it, it dropped uh, a f couple months ago... Um, he has changed his tune now and wants to be... Oh, you pie peppy. ...part of the, the whole thing. Oh, jumping on the bandwagon. Yeah. And I'm like, you know what? You can't have both. You can't come out and say, and yell at this guy and say, how dare you, and you're a piece of shit, and your movie's gonna suck, and then be like, I'd like to be a part of your film. I'd like to be a part That's of your... because he knows that a right man can do it right. 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 Right man. man. Right man. Right man! He's the right man for it! He's the right man! I love it. I love it. Um, I'm, I'm. We're giving I'm you big really, props here, brother. I know. I'm really hoping it's a good movie. The trailer looked great. Even just watching the trailer, it looks better than Paul's. Thank you. Yes, it does. <laughs> I'm excited, and it's got uh, Paul Rudd. So mm -hmm. yeah, Paul Rudd's pretty good. Yeah. I give him. He's in Sausage Party. Right? Out of out of <laughs> out of one out of ten, I give him an eight. There you go. There you go. That's a solid eight. He's not British, so he can't get a 10. That Paul can get a good grade. <laughs> the other Paul, no. You're not even on the scale. No, no. Minus 10. So, uh, Baby Yoda Child. Mm -hmm. Baby Yoda Child. <laughs> Baby know, Yoda Child. This one has to do with merchandise. Yep. For Funko. I love Funko. Making a Baby Yoda. Excellent. You know, it wasn't here in time for Christmas. Of course not, because we would have wanted it. Star Wars fans looking to stuff a little extra cuteness in some of stockings holiday season. Ah, stuffing your stocking. We'll have to wait, as Aww. we've seen. 
but at least Baby Yoda is going to become a real toy thing. Funko, the Everett Wash based creator of pop culture merchandise, announced that it will be creating a pop figure for the child, aka Yoda. Baby Yoda. Pop music. Talk a about Yoda looking pop character music. that has people going goo and ga. <laughs> Goo and ga! All through the new Disney Plus live-action streaming series, The Mandalorian. This adorable little alien is a perfect addition to your pop collection, Funko said in a blog post. But those big green ears won't be poking through any... Uh, <laughs> poking through! Anyone's wrapping paper <laughs> recently for Christmas or your birthday. Yeah. The item which will be available in standard pop size, a 10-inch version, won't be available for shipment until spring, but you can pre-order one now. Funko promises additional details are coming. Well, bring them on, bitch. <laughs> the company holds the licenses for a wide variety of popular movie, TV, and comic book characters mm -hmm. and throwing in other Star Wars pop figures. And on its website, including the actual Mandalorian, who is Baby Yoda's sidekick after all. Sidekick. He's only the, you know, main character of the show. Mattel is also getting in on the child toy game with an 11 inch plus doll. CNBC reported that the $25 product is also available for pre order and won't be in anyone's hands anytime soon yet. And I'm going to hold up a picture. And that's crazy. Here's what the fun coat is going to look like. Okay. That's video only. We can't show the, uh, the, the, Pick. Can't show the pick on audio. <laughs> nope. Audio people, you gotta go over to the video on YouTube and or, check us up. Or and Google you can it. See what it looks like there. Or Google it. But I mean, if you're gonna go to YouTube, no, you might as well subscribe. Go over. I show you. I'll show you. I show you. I'll show I show you. you. You come here now. I show you. <laughs> I show you picture. <laughs> you haven't seen it? I show you. I show you. Watch our video. Uh, real quick. Well, time's up. I know, I know. I'm sorry. Um, I'm not. What the fuck was I going to say? I don't know. Ah, See, so what I'm getting old. I'm getting old. Yeah, when, uh, it's like we forgot the title a few episodes couple, ago. A couple episodes ago, we had uh, With uh, Joe. Joe on. And we were we were, we're a couple years older than he, he is, so we were telling him all the fun shit that he's got to look forward to. Oh, he's already <laughs> starting to experience some of it. What, the knees cracking and shit? Is he doing that? I forget what it exactly. I think it is. Oh, I guess stand up. You should hear mine. Pop. Yeah. Every time I stand up, <clears throat> it's like having you know a couple what? pieces of popcorn in your hand and just crunching it. You know what? I mean, that would be bad enough. But I mean, if I could go all night without waking up to pee, that'd be fantastic. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say if I can go all night having sex. Well, I mean, you know. all night, I have. <laughs> couple hours and then I get shit to do. I feel like a lot of people say, oh yeah, we, we can go all night. I'm sure they don't. You got stuff to do. <laughs> you know, no lady wants that. I guarantee you, no lady wants that. Because she's sitting there going, I got to do dishes. I got to do laundry. You know, I'm, rather have sex and do I got dishes? stuff to do. I, I'm very busy, Sean. I'm very busy. I got stuff to do. So does he. <laughs> I got a friend of mine. Um, who's having heart surgery soon. Hello, friend having heart surgery soon. <laughs> and he actually called me this week, and he said, I'm having heart surgery this day. And I said, oh, wow, man, that sucks. And he goes, yeah. And then he goes, I know you're very busy. <laughs> he said, but is there any way I can see you before my surgery? And I said, I will pencil you in. <laughs> you will be penciled in. Which means I can erase you anytime I want. <laughs> That's true. If I put it in with pencil, it's not permanent. <laughs> no, no, no. I, uh, I'm going to try like heck. Try like heck. I didn't want to, and then it was like, I, we were on the phone together and I felt like he wanted me to commit to a day. And I'm just like, I'm going to have to sit down and think about it and get back. To I really only have a couple of days free and I was waiting to find out, um, because my, sister lost her father-in-law this week and so i was Sorry waiting yeah that sucked and so i was waiting to hear about um any kind of arrangement so i didn't want to commit to a day because i was terrified that the day i commit to the friend will be the day that 
I, you know, there'll be services, and I'll be like, fuck! So then I, I, I don't like, you know, having to rearrange things. I was like, hey, sorry about that. So, I just said, I'll get back to you. <laughs> Which sounds like a dick thing, but he understood, so. <laughs> that definitely helps. I'll get back to you. With your, with your shit. <laughs> I know. Well, we're going to say goodbye to the YouTube folks because last week we had a huge problem where we went too long. And YouTube... Can't even see how far in we are. Huh? Can't even uh, see what time is. We're about, we're about half an hour in. And uh, YouTube decided that the video was too long and cut... At 40 just, minutes. Just cut. It was about 38, I think. Uh, you know, between 38 and 40, and that was too long for them, so they just cut it. We were getting ready to end, too. I know! That's the fucked up thing, is we were getting ready to finish. We were wrapping it up. And uh, they wrapped it up for us. We were coming to an end. <laughs> we were wrapping it up, and they decided to wrap it up for us, so... <laughs> um, we definitely don't want that to happen again, so we're gonna have to... You know, if we had more subscribers, we could just be live. <coughs> and go for as long as you, as long as you like. I know. Show love this week. We need subscribers. I don't see any reason why we can't hit a thousand maybe by like Easter. I'm going to put Easter as like, because you can be like, hippity hop, go subscribe. I don't know. <laughs> Fucking do it. Hop on over and subscribe. Hop on over and subscribe. So thank you guys so much. I'm going to shut up now. <laughs> Sean's writing it down because he'll forget. <laughs> I'm going to shut up now. Sean's got something to tell you. Don't forget to wash your apples. And, uh, I don't know. Just be nice. Be nice. Be nice to people while they're still around. I don't know. Sean. <laughs> have a good everything. And if there's someone that you want to uh, have around temporary, pencil them in. <laughs> Erase them later. Damn right.